CNN analyst Rick Santorum wants everybody to leave Trump alone and allow him to, to process his feelings. Take a look. Give people time. Yes. I mean, you know, the, the, you know he's just found out that, that he's you know, probably not going to be the president of the United States here. And I mean, you could say what was in the cards, but, but you don't know until the votes are counted. I mean, listen to John King. You don't know. It's not his schedule. It's, so, the, it's democracy's but, but schedule. Give, it's not Donald give Trump's. Give his supporters and everybody time but, to figure this out. With, with Hillary Clinton, we, that's what we Which is why, David, thank you for the comment that, you know, saying, you know, we'll, we'll take trespassers out of the White House. It's not time to, you know, I under, that, I that kind of that. rhetoric I, is I agree not going to be helpful. This is a very emotional time. Had either side under this election it would would have. I mean, that's why they were. No offense, Anderson. That's why they're boarding up places in you know across the country because they were afraid of you know if if, if Joe Biden was going to win by ten points and he loses fraud. I mean, this would be this would be the cry of the other side too. Let the process work. I, I remember Give when Hillary, people I remember, space to work I, through this. And I remember, I, all right. Uh, with all due respect, Van Jones, shut up. All right. This is not the time for your bullshit civility. <laughs> All right. Um, no, this is great. This is this is this is the definition of Schadenfreude. And I know I probably uh, said it wrong. I've got German viewers. Apologies. Uh, but look, I think it's funny. Oh, do you need time, Rick Santorum? Do you need a little bit of grief counseling? Is Trump having a sad? Are you having a sad? Oh. Now, look, I know a lot of you might be thinking, why you got to be a dick like that, Jeff? Come on. What the fuck's wrong with you? No, it's because the entire conservative movement under Donald Trump has been focused on liberal tears. So excuse me if I say fuck you. <laughs> All right? Uh, see, here's the thing. The difference between conservatives and, and, and progressives is, hey, it turns out I want to make the country better. Hey, I want to make the country better. And so I want people to have health care. I want people to have a clean environment. I want people to have higher wages, right? His entire side is, is based on owning the fucking libs. That's their entire ideology. That's their entire movement. They don't care about policy. They don't give a shit about making people's lives better unless it's their own. And so that's the problem that I have with Rick Santorum. And now he's saying, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. You guys need time. You guys need to give us time to, to kind of process our fee-fees. No, shut the fuck up. You look, I, I, I'm going to say it. You lost. You lost. That's it. Like, Donald Trump has to, it, it's suiting. Like, Joe Biden's going to go make a statement in later today. Okay. And by the time this probably goes up on YouTube uh, as a clip, he might have already made that statement. I'm pretty sure he's going to say, we've seen enough. We've won this election. All right, great. Uh, now, after that, it is up to Donald Trump to go and, and say, okay, we did our best. We campaigned our asses off, uh, but we, didn't, we came up short. Unfortunate. Is he going to do that? No. He's going to cry. Why? Because that's what he's been doing for the past uh, look, for the past couple of days, not only has he cried, but he also says, oh, I actually won it. I didn't lose. Uh, you guys lost. I didn't, I didn't lose. I won. I won. And all the votes uh, that didn't go to me are fraudulent. Bullshit. Absolute bullshit. So understand that, no, I don't feel bad for you. If you're a MAGA guy, I don't feel bad for you at all for losing. But at the same time, I also want you to have fair wages. I want you to have high wages. I want you to have health care. I want you to have a clean environment. And I want you to be able to go to grief counseling uh, so that you can, you know, talk to a therapist uh, about your seemingly weird obsession about drinking liberal tears. That's it. And so, unfortunately, of course, there's a lot of Trump supporters that whenever they get in the power show, they want the exact opposite. Uh, for members of the LGBTQ plus community, they want to literally kill people, have them not be alive. And so that's kind of the big difference. Uh, but look, in the words of many of conservatives, uh, I just want to say uh, from the bottom of my heart, uh, fuck your feelings, AOC 2024. If you enjoyed this video, 
please give us a like and share with your friends. You can subscribe and help out the channel by becoming a patron. It's patreon.com slash Jeff Waldorf. Or you can become a channel member as well by hitting the join button below.